the COMPT enzyme is reduced in its functioning from high estrogen, okay? Not necessarily a gene mutation, okay? So the COMPT enzyme, if it is simply overloaded with too much estrogen, then it's going to act slow. It doesn't matter if you've got a gene mutation on COMPT or not. In fact, you can have no gene mutation on COMPT and it can slow down due to having too much estrogen. So what can cause too much estrogen? Definitely having high histamine, as that will increase estrogen. Having um, high beta-glucuronidase enzyme in the gut, as that will deconjugate estrogen, making it more active, so you've got more active estrogen. Being constipated, if you don't poop out your estrogen, you're going to have high estrogen, okay? So also, you know, in the perimenopause phase, when progesterone is much lower than estrogen. Our estrogen can actually be three times higher than when it was when we were younger. Okay, now this can slow down the functioning of this COMPT enzyme. Okay, so I so often get questions from patients about my, sl my slow COMPT or my fast COMPT. Don't worry about it. Worry about what is causing you to have high estrogen and work on that. Because if you're just trying to work on a gene, you can't just work on a gene mutation. You can't treat a gene mutation. You have to think about the enzyme that that gene is governing and coding for and what is happening to that enzyme in real time.